right, we got a new hand shaping up, and Jacob, by the way, quickly becoming one of my favorite players. Yes. The guy got some chips, and he got frisky. And he's just going to be pounding away. Uh, we do have a raise. Uh, looks like... Where did that original raise come? Uh, from Ace-9 from Tim. We are five ways to this flop. This is actually making the stream a lot of fun for me that we're seeing multi-way flops. Usually, like in our typical Wednesday 5-5 game, there's like We've a big raise pre. Flops. It's going two or three ways. Like this one's like four or five-way flops. I, I feel like you're trying to make fun of me, but I don't, I don't understand where you're going with it, so I'm going to ignore you. It's probably the wisest decision. <laughs> And here we go, 10 jack 3 rainbow board. Open, Jacob did yeah, open so with jack 5. Over to Jacob top Jacob. pair, John John is calling, and we're around to Tim, our original pre-flop raiser, ace 9. He wants to call, he's gonna call. And Ryan, are you coming along for the ride with 9-7? Wow, these guys, they just wanna see a turn card so bad. Okay, so two players with 9-7 and John John's gonna play it strong. That is the best card for Tim. And John John. Yep. Oh, for Tim? Yep. Why for Tim? Oh, because oh, they now flush, yep. Jesus. Am I even here? We've got two guys turn straights, one guy turns the nut flush. The guy that's leading all the action, Jacob, just becomes a huge dog with a z when it says zero next to wow. your name like that if you're new to the stream oh wow look at this so wow Tim. and they both just added on these are brand new wow. 500 dollars additions to their chips 400 and to go re-ray cray cray we might see a three-way <laughs> that's hot yeah <laughs> <laughs> Wow, what a spot to put Ryan in. He's like, I got the second nut hand. He's like, I really wish I didn't rebuy this hand. Oh, wow. Or add on, should I say. Like, how do you get away from this? That's the question. How do you freaking get away from this? Tim putting max pressure on. Uh, I said 400, the graphic says 500. So those greens must be stacks of five, which would make it 500. Yes. So. Let's recap. It's gone from 125 oh, from John fold. John. Tim raises to 500. And Ryan's just like, what the hell, man? I was so happy when I saw that turn card. And I, all this action, he oh. lets it go. What a fold. I don't know if it's a good fold. I mean, it's probably just, a good fold because of the action. But wow. I just think there's wow. more than one hand that raises that much. There's a lot of sets are going to be raising that much okay, that Tim does. I agree. Also, we've seen Tim play the bottom ends of straights very fast as well. So it's not like he's going to slow down with the bottom end of the straight. So just, yes, you think it's probably less likely we both have the same hand. But we're creating in a picture of it's more than just one hand. Yeah. So at this point, you just get it in. And, and Jacob... So you guys think Jacob is Hollywood and he's not. Jacob is an action player. He wants to be in the mix. He's He's got he's top pair. counting his outs, I think. He's going to take off his shoe and start counting on his toes as well if he needs to. Okay? Only reserve it uh, for bigger bets. But <laughs> look at Jacob. He's like, what are you doing, man? And really, though, it should be John John that should be really like, what are you doing, man? I love playing 3 9 2 3 9 Murph dog, maybe. And, and I, I have to think that John John calls it off here. He's only got 300 behind. And I think that was the point of Tim's bet is to just get heads up with someone and try to draw out. Or, you know, of course, if everyone folds, that's great too. Yeah. Does John John give Tim credit right here for nine queen? Because if John John only gives Tim credit for a set or a nut draw to the flush, he has to call. Yeah, I mean, and just with your stack, you put in over a quarter of your stack left, you're just going to get it in. Because when you're folding incorrectly, it is monumentally bad. Oh, it was like a fake out call. All right, let's see what these guys are talking about. Or do you write a one? Am I allowed to ask that? Yeah, yeah, definitely. If I go in, you run it three times? I was told this is live. You can do anything. <laughs> Within the rules. Yeah, yeah. Even outside the rules, you can do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. What happens between the stone stage? Oh, okay, okay. I like that. You know what? That's the same thing they told me when I was working security at Harris and Harvey's in, in Tahoe. There's a lot of affairs. What, like legal affairs? A lot of affairs. If I show my hand, is it red? Yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. 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 I escorted a lot of high-end people in back in the back of the casino. No. No. Not me. <laughs> no, I was the security. Oh, okay. That was you. That was you. No, I was the security. You guys look too much alike. No. You mean with like, um. He was my You mean with like escorts? No, no. Everyone. Or with the staff? No, like a security yeah. escort. Like high end. <laughs> like my last <laughs> three were, were, was Pitbull and um, the guy from like, um, um, what's his name? Uh, Adam Sandler, he plays a lot of- God! He folds! What a play by Tim! Unbelievable! What a freaking play by Tim! Hey, Chris, are you okay? Huh? What? Chris, Chris Wake me up is... when he calls. Wake wow. me up when he calls. What a squeeze! Wow. He gets two second nut straights to fold on a board that is, that is amazing. not paired. Yeah. It doesn't have no. three to a flush yet. On the nut draw, gets two second wow. nut straights to fold. That is crazy. What a play. Way to go, Tim. And that's why aggression is a good thing.